Hello everyone and welcome back to Frostpunk. Well, in this case it's not that frosty here, at least not yet. I've started the DLC in the previous video and we will continue to build a generator here. And I can say I really, really like in this game. It's amazing how they turn things around and introduce new mechanics and basically a new story and I I like this this green map. Maybe I, I know there is a city builder uh, which is uh, takes place in the north and it's uh, uh, medieval times or, or even before medieval times like or maybe some uh, Viking themed. I don't know exactly the name, but I think the the game has some north something in the title. Uh, and I might oh, there are seagulls here. So what I'm getting at, I'm I might try that one, but I I really like the aesthetics of this. Okay, we will bring in 10 workers here. And we are building this tough structure. And we have to build, uh, what are we researching? Upgraded docks. And we also need uh, to build a machine shop yes okay now let's get to work by the way if you if you like this video please consider to leave a like uh, or subscribe to the channel and also i'm always welcome comments and some tips as long as they are not spoiled things for the game This is a first time uh, playing series, so I, I like to explore by myself. Yeah, I don't think we don't. I think I, we don't need this anymore. Okay, we need to finish this, that's for sure. And we are still ahead of schedule a bit, and I would like to keep that. But uh, this toxicity is, or not is, it will those problems I'm sure of that. I want to know just a bit of ventilation plan which improves work safety up across the construction site consuming we will improvise a whole construction site with fresh air improving safety in all workplaces. Yeah I think we will need uh, one of those two, which means we will need coal. I'm thinking we, we might get away without it, but, but I think we will need that. Because of the toxic uh, gases that are coming from the hole. And how is our health care? We only have two medical posts, so we have to build at least two more, I think. Also, it would be nice to increase the motivation. A taste of home. Sir, all too many people back home are facing starvation, a well of relative of one of our engineers sent him a large parcel full of tweets. Should we hold on to the food, it may steer trouble or, God forbid, uh, fuel a parallel economy. 
50 food rations. We don't even have the storage for that. Give the man his parcel. And he can divide that uh, to his co workers or tent mates as he sees fit. Fortunately, we are maxed out with food. Okay, upgraded dogs resurged. And unfortunately, we will we'll not. Oh, maybe we will research something if it not requires uh, steel. But everything is required. Everything requires steel to a certain extent. Yeah. Hmm. We need the medical post upgrade. Yeah, let's do this. And I think we will be still fine. Five per hour. need an extended shift that will guarantee that we can build a machine workshop during the night time the toxicity is ri uh, uh, rising Cozy refuge. A cast iron stove stands beside the desk and a sturdy chair. Two books lie on the desk. On the origin of species by means of nat natural selection or the preservation of favored races in the struggle for life. By Charles Darwin, M.A. and Voyage of Central Lida Terra. Uh, a novel by Jules Verne. Ah, that's the uh, voyage to the central of the earth. There's also a crate of uh, canned food here. These are good books. We'll read them someday, but for now, let's take the food. Railroad track. Let's move the workers here and we will dismantle this. And we will build another one near there. We need 10 structural profiles for the second one. Upgraded dogs would be also nice, but first thing first, we need a machine shop. So we will know, I think we have to feed uh, iron or steel to it.
And we have to work towards to make another dock. And we need to build another fishing dock as well, or fishing harbor. Fifty one percent. Yeah, this will need steel and the ventilation thing you need needs coal. Twenty steel, yeah. We will need a foundry as well. Process pressure steam exchanger used at the construction site to speed up the work on the generator. Each use advances work progress by 10% and cost time steam exchangers. Yeah, this is because the toxic gas. Also, didn't build a sawmill. Besides researching, we need we need more workers. Let's bring ten more, and an engineer. So we have to build two tents. Okay. 
Get on up. Work's not gonna wait. Railroad track runs from one horizon to the other. It's enormous. The rails are almost knee high and run on a very wide uh, sleepers. Door house. Let's go this. Because our food supplies is dwindling down. And we can build that. Let's do this so we can have a lot, a lot of food. Bad omen. This morning the camp is strangely quiet. People pass their bad news in hushed voices. An owl is perched atop a scaffolding, despite it being uh, broad daylight. They were superstitions even in the best of times, but here in this remote harsh place uh, they see it as a worst omen, worse than a herd of black cats. The construction site the workers refuse to return to work while the bloody bird uh, sits there. They uh, also say that shoo it away would bring even worse luck. What shall we do? Put it away. Let's keep up the motivation. So, where are the workers? We have 10 dedicated to build this. Rome is dressed. So people complain that the the short shift law you uh, sang some time ago still has not been put into effect. I've heard enough promises in my life. I'm not going to wait for a says an older welder. A former knows and says, if our boss counts us on forgetting what he said, he's going to be disappointed and it's hard to keep motivation up when people feel they've been cheated. Damn it. Okay, let's do the shortened shifts here. How about that? And since we are waiting for resources for building...
Okay, it seems the shortened shift only applied to these buildings here. We have 10 free workers. The store is filled with uh, crates used to transport steam cores, dozens of them enough to power an entire fleet of dreadnoughts. Most of the crates are empty. empty. Steam cores, this rules. Okay, I don't, uh, I don't speak French, sorry. The sign over the uh, entrance says Ministre de la Marine at the colonies. It's not surprising that uh, other nations also seek refuge in the north, but the scale of this operation is astonishing. An ancient storekeeper opens uh, a big ledger uh, at our side. The old man apparently took us uh, for French engineers. Bonjour, Monseigneur. Okay, I don't read uh, the other. He seems to offer us a shipment of steam cores, but what the heck is wave needs? Hmm. Let's explain a misunderstanding because uh, we are good with steam cores right now. Honestly, above all, we told the storekeeper about his mistake for a moment. We weren't uh, sure whether he's about to burst into anger or tears. Then he closed his ledger and muttered a single sentence before he left. Merci, Monsignors. Okay. Tonight we are upgrading the docks. Shifts over. Stow your tools. And we're doing the fishing nets, okay. We can introduce the new law. Working on shore shifts are well rested if they work carefully, we can use their full potential. Okay, that would be a good one, but we also need, I think, something for the eels. We have the sustained life. A really will be kept alive but untreated in medical cause. Motivation will rise slightly. A really ill will take up beds in medical costs and I believe in the labor tree. We have the dispenser, new bed, first gravy ill to ill with uh, potent chemical medicines. You have uh, the dispensary treatment can have side effects. But this is the only way we can save the grave ears because we can't uh, we can't use the amputees. Or we can build care houses, but Wow! It will be adjacent to street. Okay. 
Okay. You finish this. You can also manage. High motivation. Sir, people are so highly motivated that many of them prefer their jobs with enthusiasm. The efficiency in all work which is rising as a result. Well done. Yeah, but we have to keep that up. Somehow. Wait, we need to upgrade the docks. And we also need to build another We can build the upgraded docks immediately. Let's do that. And we will have 10 workers for this dock to pile up resources there. And we can build that uh, thing in the next day. Oh, even building the morgue will raise motivation. Come on, build it. Before the sun rises. About five, about three hours. Okay. Let's produce steel there as well. Because we will need steel to operate that. Oh damn! Workers trapped. Certain explosion in the generator's foundation caused a tunnel collapse, trapping several workers. Unfortunately, we can't send a rescue team since we don't have one. Due to low priority given to the workplace safety in the shaft, the crews working there lack uh, adequate uh, uh, training. Okay, blow up the cave in. Okay, we need that ventilation system thingy.
this. This huge locomotive lies on its side. It's a view both majestic and pathetic. The engine is un unbelievably huge. Like a bridge ship, it was overturned when the ground gave way under its massive weight and the tracks buckled. There's an inscription on its main boiler. Oh, that was the what he asked. Surely the French have a taste for dimensions. Pity that the land has let them down. Now we can only salvage the resources from this magnificent machine. Yeah, let's... Oh, okay. Right, terminal. I think we will go around here and then head back to the construction site. Or when we really, really, really need steam cores. About five hours. That's good. Oh, we need to build another one of this. Okay, I see. Construction uh, stack strike. Sir, people uh, at the construction site stopped working. Uh, worker climbs uh, an overturned uh, wheelbarrow and shouts to his fellows. We saved our friends, sure, this time, but as long as the uh, deadline is more important than us, such catastrophes will keep happening. Who's going to slave now to repair the damage? And how many of us won't make it home in one piece? Great. Okay, now we don't make it. But if you are striking... Oh, let's negotiate. Workers are on strike. Workers are angry and refuse to work. They shout about exploitation, terrible working conditions, and deadly danger they face daily. What will you promise them? You have to raise uh, uh, work uh, pay safety above dangerous. Comfortable. Content will rise greatly, demands might escalate. I need to think about it. In a few hours, the ventilation plant will be will be complete. Twenty per hour, so in three hours, okay. But we have to have enough uh, materials to build it. And that's why I want uh, it to finish the research and see if we can actually build the freaking building. Long hours of toil, sir, or people are worn out. Some of them have been working on extended shifts uh, for days on end. Their effort is taking its toll and they're becoming restless. They deserve a break. They might go on strike if we ignore them. 
Okay, good idea. Let's do that and we can introduce a new law. Company funerals. Those who give their lives in service of the Empire deserve the highest honor. We will send their bodies to England in steel coffins and bury them at the company's expense. Uh, no, I, I don't want to do that. We need this. We start to lower this content. Okay, ventilation plant surge, and we have just enough to build it. Okay, the next thing, what we need, I think, I think we need uh, this. That's very, very unfortunate. Let's negotiate with them. Like is resolved, people resume to work. This content fails. Who should we lean on? The first strike is over, but it won't be the last. We need to address the labor issues if we are finished the generator or schedule. Workers would like to be given a voice and be involved in decisions uh, while engineers promise you results if you rely on their proven expertise. You empower the workers and establish the labor union or strengthen the engineers role and build the factory inspectorate. Mm, engineers don't do much except uh, of the research which is very very important but we have a lot of workers here so let's lean on the workers for now that seems the logical thing So we have to build it as soon as we can. Great. Workers, your work is over for today. The big double doors of the warehouse are open. Inside there's a stack of crates full of canned food uh, with French labels. As we take stock of the food supply, several workers appear and ask us if we understand their French, whether the Pavnig is coming soon because living here is becoming unbearable. They've been apparently waiting for their train for quite some time, sustaining themselves on canned food. Uh, we will tell them the truth. I hope it will be pay off. We told the poor Frenchmen that nobody is coming for them. They immediately started packing their food, preparing to set out. Oh, 
Okay, now. This building provides a poor construction site with fresh air, improving safety in all other places. Okay. They are not active. It is not active yet. We have to build a damn union. This is, is just then still. But the labor union 25 still. Oh, that means we can build it if we find the place. Next to the morgue. That's how it's done. That labor union keeps an eye on safety conditions in all workplaces in the construction We won't finish this. I think that that uh, this head is ahead of schedule. Uh, that's just uh, BS <laughs> to make the the player feel safe and not to worry about things. don't have enough well at nine so we have to do rails are uh, covered with ice sometimes disappearing under it but follow them until they are no longer visible Track to nowhere. After the track disappeared under the ice, uh, we followed its general direction for a couple of miles, seeing nothing on the horizon. Then backtracked and uh, found out trying to find the place where the track comes back. It seems that it does not. Where did the track lead? We might never know. Okay, and we have something in here. Let's, no, let's uh, move there instead and check that out.
I'm sure we will need 10 more, 10 more workers. And one more engineer. Oh, then we have to wait a few hours. Okay, will this thing will help? station but what we really need to finish this but at least we have a good motivation so tomorrow we can finish this part of the the work and we need at least one more no we need three more end of a world sir an engineer received a letter from relatives in India they explained that a sudden uh, force devastated their plantation and they are going back to England as the colony is de uh, descending into chaos and population is rising up against the British rule. Surely we cannot let such information impact the morale of our people. Okay, now we will censor this. And we are making our own demise by it, I'm sure of it. 50 steel. for coal. And I think we need to 
gathering force. And I cannot put it to uh, have or there. do this and keep the motivation up because at any time I know any time the motivation can go down sharply because this is this is how this game works this inaccessible rock is a nesting place for numerous birds the ground around it's covered with uh, fish remains A lake full of fish and collapsed mine. We need uh, a storage for food so we can bring these guys back. This means we need another soul meal. Build that freaking road. What? All that resource is gone if we switch? Damn it. Harbingers of Doom. People across the whole camp leap uh, to their feet, awakened by sounds of angry screeches. Dozens of whoosh birds are circling over the construction site. The owls are back, more uh, terrified workers. It's a sign the heavens war, uh, warn us. Shouldn't be here, we're doomed. Uh, after a while, the birds disappear above the bay, leaving our people several circulation with her even more each morning. Indeed. Transport ship has arrived. Okay, uh, then let's put five here. It's a coal mine, but it has been evacuated after the collapse. 
This coal mine has been abandoned. Okay. Because they have five steel thingy. But I don't want to miss out on some food. Wood can steal. Safety improvements. Worst modification which will improve workplace safety uh, at the machine shop by one level. I see. An additional ventilation plan, effective fans. Then the ventilation plans using more efficient ventilation levels which cost us full use. Cuts for use by 50%. Yeah, I would like that. We need that. Oh, and we haven't... It's maxing out the workers. We will wait. Eight hours, so it will be tomorrow. What kind of collective bargain? Collective uh, bargain negotiates with all workers is currently on strike. Labor Union Workers Council. Council Square. Workers' motivation will rise slightly every day. Council Square's lower strike list in nearby workplaces by one. Discontent will fall slightly. These heavy wooden crates are used to transport valuable or fragile goods. They are stenciling with uh, prominent signs warning against dropping them. Finders keepers. Inspecting their crates, we found some steam exchangers and steel composites. 
This volume resources uh, must be uh, destined for the winter home construction site, but it seems they got uh, mislaid, fell off trailer or something. No, we are taking the crates. And we are going back. We badly need that shipment here. We are producing enough food, so we might do this. What? Time to rest. It is not working because of road issues. What the actual hell? We need one more day to finish this. And for the second stage, we need uh, 10 steel exchangers and 10 of these things. Well, my only hope is this motivation. Okay, let's do it one hour. Okay. Okay, that's great. That means if we do those profiles, we can continue with the second stage. Go for the cargo convoy. Well, I might be just uh, remove the workers here for a day because we are, yeah. They didn't sell the story. If the story is, is has some storage capacity, which we reach, uh, then I think I will just simply, simply employ the uh, workers there. To be perfectly honest, I thought we will be uh, finished with the first uh, part by this time.
but I was apparently very, very wrong. But I don't think we have more than 40 days to finish the project. We don't know. About 12 hours ahead of schedule. Okay. Okay, we may be, may, we will be maybe just in time. Those crates helped a lot. If we are if we are so good with food right now we might opt for hard meals in the next low five hours if I remove five workers Seven hours. Oh, we don't need that. Okay. We can go for the five hours because these guys can still produce what we need. Yeah. Okay. The nun and start gathering by hand same here Of course, it would require more rules. Rules and regulations have changed. Three food rations from three raw food. Okay. Let's hope. Come on! Efficient fans search. Okay. So mill range looks very very good, but we need to do protective structures. Each is willing to work safety by one level for two hours. Cost of six structural profiles. of uh, structure profiles I think workers are on strike the cars angry refuse to work they should about exploitation okay and it will rise tomorrow so it will be even worse we need another ventilation plant and we can turn on and off these Oh, but we can only need 50 steel. Let's, let's go for 50 steel. Okay, so we have to research 
this to build another one. Okay, I hope this will work at least this one time. Workers reject your offer. After a short but heated discussion strike, uh, force reject your proposal. Say subscribe for your lab dogs. You... Okay, you fat bloodsucker. When a motion subside workers, representative approach you with a proposition. These are our demands. Meet them and we are uh, off to work. Otherwise, the strike will continue. Okay, short shift in construction. I can live with that. Ju just finish this thing. You don't even have to work here uh, uh, for long. And we will work on the safety part of things once we have finished this research. No! Stop it! So if you give your people time, okay, motivation rises. I don't click on that event until this is finished. Come on. Finally. Milestone achieved. Next milestone, build the foundations. Before laying the foundation which will support the massive block of the generator, you will have to send your workers deep below the ground level and install the powerful uh, tower pumps there. One man, one vote. Sir, the labor union uh, you agree uh, needs to representatives, but workers, if left uh, their own devices, will probably choose a subversive activist to represent them. How shall we proceed? Okay, let them choose. Okay, let's build a foundation. What? What pressure valve? What? Okay, now. Uh, I need to look around what's happening here. So. Uh, build, the phone, build the machine shop, install the pressure valves, install the tower pumps. I see. And here... Ah, I see. Okay. So those are different uh, projects. Okay. Let's start with this.
also need to build another tent. Well, we slowly but uh, surely run out of wood. Oh, it's just 16 hours to finish. Let's do this for 21 hours. Abandoned site. Congratulations on completing your first milestone on schedule. Meanwhile, after funding cuts and catastrophic accidents at site 107, the project was scrapped and remaining workers scheduled for evacuation. If you can spare the men, order foragers to search the coordinates and recover whatever materials you can. We will have far from enough generators to evacuate everyone should the unthinkable happen. Your task is now even more important. We should double our efforts. Okay. Nature sculpture. Let's go there instead of there. Oh, but that's a cargo convoy. We check both sides. Okay, we need the we need this. Okay, we have the machine shop. And when we... Uh, we are really, really out of food now. Okay, this is this is tricky. This scenario is very very tricky. And I think we need these stuff here to effectively gather the resources from the docks. Or we should build more gathering posts. I don't know. there just to be on the safe side what is our food balance it's not good but maybe we don't have to ask for more workers the construction site so I can do this I hope okay we can do that
I don't know how far we can go. We have three days ahead of schedule. I hope we can finish this uh, uh, game. Ooh, that that's costly. That's really, really costly. Drives got out of the holders and gathered in a the circle. They seems to be trouble. Are these yours? It appears that the convoy is heading for winter home. That's a long way from here. They are carrying parts crucial for the uh, proper operation of winter home generator. It seems that they lost several crates on the way. Without them, the construction of the uh, generator might be compromised. Yep, we will, we will keep them. We already know what happens, uh, what, what transpires in winter homes, so this is how it happened. Hmm. Maybe that uh, we increase the food production here, that will solve our problem. Or we will go back to normal rations. That's also a choice. Okay guys, I think that's for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it and I catch you in the next one. Bye.